Okay. Well. Time to decide what we do next. What are we thinking? Were any of these other ones on Ilium? Uh, Citadel, Flotilla, uh, Omega, Citadel, Tichanka, Morden's Tichanka as well. Uh, random place, random place, random place, and random place. So, no other ones on Ilium. So, we can pretty much just choose whatever we want. Um... I'm feeling like maybe Kasumi. Master Thief Kasumi Goto has a problem. A ruthless arms dealer named Donovan Hawk killed her partner, Keiji Okuda, and stole Okuda's grey box, a neural implant that stores memories and information. Kasumi has planned a daring heist to recover Okuda's grey box and has asked for help in pulling it off. Once this is done, Kasumi can dedicate all her attention to completing Shepard's mission. Travel to Beckenstein, Boltzmann Serpent Nebula, and attend the party of notorious arms dealer Donovan Hawk. Alrighty. Let's go. Uh, damn, Citadel's busy. Or oh, wait, no, because Kasumi's this one, but she's not actually at the Citadel, so I guess the area near the Citadel is busy. <laughs> Ah, zero percent. We will definitely scan the fuck out of this joint before we go down. Fane man. Uh, lots of development. Da -da -da. Nothing particularly interesting. It's a poor joint. Nothing much to find. Moving on. Thoof. Dwarf planet, originally put on star charts. Moderate. Any ESO to be found? Nope. Veltman. Uh, Dynamics Corporation's facility for manufacturing metastable metallic hydrogen. Citadel warships use the substance in their thrusters and are frequently seen docking there. Makes it one of the most heavily patrolled in Citadel space. Still poor though. Wheeler. Moderate. Oh, that was a fat spike of that. I thought it was fatter than that. Maybe not. Whatever. And last but not least, the joint we're going to. The recipient of the first wave of Earth's colonization efforts, Beckenstein's founders had a decidedly less agrarian plan than Eden Prime. The mission of Beckenstein's first colony was to become Earth's off-planet manufacturing base, ingratiating humanity into galactic culture by producing needed goods. Meeting with mixed success for the first generation, Beckenstein then leapfrogged its competition by producing high-quality luxury goods that went straight to nearby markets via the Citadel. Today, Beckenstein is known as the Human's Ilium, a place where new money tycoons flaunt their wealth and the have-nots are rarely spoken of. Very small population. Scanner results depleted? I guess that's because the humans have already come here and depleted it themselves? Because I certainly haven't been here before. Huh. Interesting. Never seen that before. Right, let's go. Uh, oh fuck, I didn't think... I don't actually know how to change this. Because I unlocked that thing from uh, Miranda, but I, I didn't think about how you actually 
change it. Well, I guess I'll figure it out after the mission. Uh. Wait, I tried to I tried to go right trigger, but it wouldn't let me. I guess can you not bring a can you not bring a second squad mate on this one? I mean, I guess it doesn't really matter in terms of lines because Jack had literally one line in that entire thing, but I guess it's just done differently. Overload again. Area overload, but we'll be using your fucking rapid shadow strike because holy fuck, is that the best ability in the game or what? That shit is amazing. Oh hey, you've got a flashbang, right. So I guess I would have I would get this from you if it hadn't bugged out and given it to me at the start. Zoomies You clean up well, Mr. Solomon Gunn. Hawk won't know what hit him. I assume Solomon Gunn is my cover. You run a small but talented band of mercs out in the Terminus systems. Precisely the type of person Hawk respects. I took the liberty of giving you a reputation. Papers, witnesses, article in Badass Weekly. I was already in Badass Weekly, thank you very much. You, and you'll be fine. Remind me, what kind of man are we dealing with? Dickhead? Hawk's a weapons dealer and smuggler. He killed my partner and stole his grey box. Other than that, he's not so bad. Rich, charismatic, willing to crack open a man's skull to get at the neural implants inside. You know, the usual. I take it I'm wearing this getup for a reason. You'd look really out of place at a society party in armor, don't you think? You look great. You should wear this stuff more often. You trying to fucking hit on me? Why is everyone trying to hit on me today? I mean, I know I'm fucking gorgeous, but still. Now's probably a good time to fill me in on the details. You have been waiting patiently. Our friend, Hawk, is throwing a party for his closest Ooh. friends. Hello. A couple dozen of the worst liars, cheaters, and mass murderers you'll ever want to meet. All bringing gifts as a tribute to the man himself. Our tribute is a lovely statue of your old friend, Saren, rendered with loving detail and filled to the brim with our weapons and armor. <laughs> nice. You can keep your pistol as long as it's concealed. They won't hassle you over a side arm. Once inside, we'll make our way to Hawk's vault door, somewhere in the back of the ballroom. Then, we case the security and start peeling away the layers. The statue should be there, waiting for you to crack it open and arm up. And then we just waltz into the vault and take back KG's gray box. And I'll finally get a chance to say goodbye. I'm sure it'll be that simple. I'm sure we'll def definitely just waltz in and that'll be that. You've worked really hard on this. KG must have meant a lot to you. Was I that obvious? KG's gray box holds a lot of priceless personal memories. It's all that remains of who he was. But the secret he discovered is dangerous. I wouldn't bring you here if it wasn't. What's in the gray box that makes it worth all this trouble? The gray box holds KG's memories. Everything from all the codes and plans he stole to all the time we spent together. Wrapped up in those memories is the secret he stole. KG never told me what it was. But the information got him killed. This ought to be interesting. That's what I'm going for. Curious to find out what that's gonna be. Imagine wanting a statue of Saren. This is our stop. Wop wop wop. After you, Mr. Gunn. Just one moment, sir. There seems to be an issue with the statue. Fucking filled with guns, is isn't there it? a problem? Yeah. Hey, no, it's this dude. Just doing a scare. Fucking twat lord. I don't believe we've met Donovan Hawk. Oh, we're about to meet real good. I've heard a lot about you. Name's Solomon Gunn. And though I've heard a lot about you, you've been very busy lately, if the extra net is to be believed. Sir. Motherfucker didn't accept the handshake. Hmm. <sighs> Now it's war. Don't think our guests would come all the way here from Ilium just to cause trouble, do you? You may pass through, Mr. Gunn, with my apologies. But I will ask your companion to remain outside. You understand, I hope. Care to explain why my friend has to stand outside? I don't like the look of your friend, so she stays outside. Simple as that. 
If it makes you feel more secure, she can wait outside. Good to see we're not going to have a problem. Enjoy the party. Do I get to punch this dude in the face well, at any point? That didn't go as I expected. Any idea why he'd send you away? No. We've never seen each other in person. And no one knows what I look like. Just watching his ass, I'm sure. I can't blame him. What do we do now? We go on with the plan. You'll just have to do all the talking. I'll stay out of sight and stick with you the best I can. We'll keep radio contact in case something goes wrong. Right, I forgot she can just do that. <laughs> yeah, I'll stay outside. Goes invisible, walks in. Okie dokie. Well, this is a different kind of mission. How did you ever contain that situation on the hull? Oh, that? A quick application of force, a little pressure, and bam, done. Thank goodness. I thought those rabble would dog you for years. What is that even a fucking painting of? Couldn't tell you. Wait, what was that? Oh, dude over there. We'll get to him in a sec. Some say Commander Shepard is still alive. Really? Oh, please. It's wishful thinking, at best. Hello, everyone. I am a robot of Commander Shepard. It is very nice to meet you. <laughs> we need to check the vault. Yeah, but I want to go in there. <laughs> uh, what have you got to say then? He's the gun. We need to case the vault gun. You can chat up Hawk later. Can I knee him in the nuts? That'd be fun. What's your read on that Archangel guy? I <laughs> hear he's dead. Or gone or something. Good riddance, I say. Are these like twins or something? Matching outfits? Uh, that looks vaulty to me. Let's just explore the rest of this place first. Uh, Private Reams. No way we can sneak out of that party. The place is locked down tight and Security Chief Roe's in charge. No way Roe would let that get past her. I'd rather stand around bored on guard duty than risk her wrath. Sorry, Samuels. Chief Roe, huh? She sounds like a hard ass. If we could tap into the guard's communications, I could probably use this information. Interesting. Damn, look at that view. Imagine being in this pool, looking out over there. That's crazy. That looks super cool. They've even got the library just over Shepard's head. Wonder if uh, Guilty Sparks are in there. <laughs> that really does look like the library. Anything to say? I hear Mr. Hawk's vault is exquisite. Who could know? He never lets anyone near it. I'll let you know. Say what's that over there? Hawk's bedroom, I believe. Wow, who's his architect? This is a very impressive place. Or a very large one, at least. Wasn't sure who was talking there. There's a button there. Can't do anything with it, though. But I feel like there's going to be something I can do with that. Hawk's private rooms are off limits without proper clearance. I'm dying to get in there, but we have to scope out the vault first. It actually says bypass. So I might even be able to do it, but I don't want to risk clicking it. Because if I did bypass it with the guard right there, then... I'd be instantly fucked, right? So, but I feel like I might actually be able to bypass that if we can get the guard away somehow. I almost just clicked accidentally because I expected it to just say examine. Very nice. There's more here than I expected. Hey, dude. Thanks for shooting yourself Passport in the head. Protected voice lock, kinetic barrier, DNA scanner. Looks like an EX-700 series. Everything a vault needs to be impenetrable. This gonna be a problem? Please, remember who you're talking to. <laughs> we'll need to get a voice sample for the voice lock. You'll have to go chat up Hawk for that. We'll have to find a password too. DNA, child's play. 
We should find plenty of DNA samples in Hawk's private quarters. And the barrier? Cut the power. Never fails. If we can find it, KG could get through a system like this in his sleep. And I'm better. Let's get to it. Nice. We still need the password and a sample of Hawk's voice to get past that scanner. Don't touch that. Without Hawk's DNA, you'll set off every alarm in the building. Makes sense. Careful. The barrier's still up. We'll have to shut it down to get to the door. Okie dokie. Let's chat up Mr. Smalldick. Hello, Mr. Smalldick. I'd like to talk to you about rumours I've heard concerning the length of your feet. There he is. All you need to do is keep him talking long enough for me to get a voice print. Pull out the charm on this one, Shep. Whenever you're ready. I've got charm for days. After you. Mr. Gunn, hope you're having a good time. That scene at the door hasn't soured your evening. I hope. Why why did she uncloak for this? Can she not use her tech whilst invisible? Surely anyone's gonna turn around and go, she looks out of place. I understand the security, but who would dare try to break into Donovan Hawk's home? Gun, in our line of work we attract a certain element. Few understand the pains we take to keep the barbarians at bay. People these days want comfort, entertainment, love. They don't see that the galaxy is fragile. I only have to worry about simple luxuries. Why? Because people like me and you are doing the terrible things that keep the galaxy spinning. This party is for us. The cleaners. The support structure for the galaxy's gleeful delusions of peace. May there always be a market for the things we do. Oh boy, I can't wait to fucking punch this dude right in his face. That's going to be very satisfying. I hope I get the opportunity. I said get him talking, and you got him talking. We've got enough of a voice sample. Oh, Let that was go. it? Damn. Enjoy the party, Mr. Gunn. Once we find the password, we can get past the voice scanner. I was expecting it to, uh... require more than that. Uh, wasn't there a door? Was it around here? Hawk throws a hell of a party. Where the fuck was yes. that door? Not too pleased was it further back this way? Security room door. Here we go. Did you? Let me unlock that security room door for you. There we go. Cheers. Great painting. Literally just a scribble. That being said, fucking love these walls. That is very nice. Ready when you are. Okay. I don't know why Kasumi isn't doing this, given it's her fucking expert area, but uh, I guess I'll do it. <laughs> what have we got? Easy, mate. Oh, shit. You can't, be back here. can't I? Tell me more. <clears throat> got strong elbows. I have an idea. See what you can find. What is this? <laughs> Nance. I have that problem too. So many passwords around here. I can't keep them straight. The password for tonight is Perugia. So it's not even that easy to remember. It's no big deal. That voice scanner means the password's only useful to Hawk anyway. After this party, want to grab some beers? Let me know. Samuels. Got something? Sure the did. password is Perugia. Huh. That's the name of the man who stole the Mona Lisa. Nice. I tapped their communications. I think we can get past that private room guard. Tell him Chief Rowe sent you. Now, I just take the voice sample we got from Hawk and... Got it. Now we can crack that voice scanner. Lovely. 7,200. Crazy numbers. Big money bowling. Uh, where was this dude? Was he just around here, I think? Mr. Hawk's private rooms are off limits to guests without security clearance. Goodbye. <laughs> I have clearance to go in. 
On whose authority? Uh... Did she tell me who to say? I've already forgotten. Obviously my own isn't going to work. I mean, I guess we should say Mr. Hawks? Hawk gave me permission to go in. Hawk knows procedure. You're not getting in till I hear it from my commander. Enjoy the party. Driving rooms. I guess I was supposed to say... That's the best place to find Hawk's DNA. Mr. Hawk's private rooms are off limits to... I have clearance to go On whose authority? I have authorization from Chief Rowe. Okay, one second. Chief Rowe, Samuels. Have you given access authorization to Mr. Hawk's private rooms? They have access, Samuels. They'll stop bothering me. Got it. Sorry to bother you, ma'am. Okay, you're clear to go in. Enjoy the party. Aight. That makes sense. I just, in my head, I was like, well, surely his Hawk's authority would outrank the person he's employing, but... Yeah, no, obviously. We needed that voice match. Look for anything we can get usable DNA from. Just make it quick and quiet. <laughs> Found a sample. Well, that was easy. No. Oh, the credit shit. One. One credit. You're joking. Oh, it was down the back of the sofa. <laughs> That's good. It's clean. It's a plant. One credit down the back of the sofa. Great. No hair, no skin flakes. The housekeepers must be thorough. He probably just buys a new bed every day or something. Not a great saliva sample, but it's still useful. We're going to need more than this for the scanner, though. Hmm. No DNA, but... Looks like Hawk's been trying to crack Cagey's grey box. Unsuccessfully? Looks like he's missing something. He hasn't cracked the encryption yet. Empty. Too bad. A cigarette butt would have been a good source. Damn. Damn, dude. Damn. Oh, fuck. I've already forgotten. Was it this one? Oh, thank God. Big money, big money. The cleaners don't dare touch treasures like this. We can get some skin cells from the dust. It's probably contaminated, though. We should find another sample. Hi. Good morning. Time to wake up. Sorry. Huh? Holographic interface. Won't find a sample here. Okuda Decryption Project Update. Little progress to report. We have now completed dictionary attacks using words and phrases from 4,800 galactic languages. R research into the Okuda family has not produced any matches. It is unlikely a random brute force approach will produce a result within our lifetimes. Given the nature of the grey box technology, it's possible that the decryption key may not be a password at all. It could be memory, an emotion, even a smell. The permutations could be infinite. I suggest that we begin investigating alternate alternative methods for breaking through the security on the box. Huh. It's going to be something that she has then. A memory she has or something. We can probably get Hawk's DNA off the data pad. He seems to have obsessed over this. That should do it. Let's get out of here. Let's skedaddle. Back downstairs. Uh, down here. Meow. Yeah. Oh, and I I forgot that we also needed to take out the power. It looks like the barrier's power cable runs under the floor here. I'll set your Omni tool to scan for electromagnetic fields. I, was I supposed to follow this the other way? I think so. <laughs> Did 
Don't mind me. What? One sec. Sure. That should take care of the barrier. <laughs> why would why on earth would you put the power source for your fucking vault barrier up on the regular floor of your house with a simple statue pole to reveal it? Feel like you'd want to hide it somewhere more secure. That got it. The barrier's down. Password required. Illusion. Voice ID accepted. Welcome, Mr. Hawk. DNA identification affirmed. Welcome, Mr. Hawk. We in, baby! I'll check for security cams. Go ahead and get dressed. No sneaking a peek. Let's fucking go. Oh, okay. Uh, yeah, sure. We're good. We good. Was that the fucking Statue of Liberty's head I just saw? So this is Hawk's fault. Very nice. This scanner will hone in on the gray box. It's not far. Incredible. Creepy. Oh, Jesus. Huh. It's called Prothean Statue. If I didn't know better, I would say that that would mean it's a statue of a Prothean, but we know that that is not what Protheans look like. Because Protheans look like collectors. And collectors don't look like that. These are one of the statues that were on... Was it Ilos? So I guess these were before Protheans? Protheans just made the statues of them? I could still get money for something like this. Even outside the Alliance. Asari go nuts for this sort of thing. Hmm. <laughs> How did Hawk get Lady Liberty's head? Damn you, Hawk! <laughs> Codex updated with Lady Liberty? How did Hawk get Lady Liberty's head? Damn you, Hawk! Hang on, is this actually... This is actually the thing. Let's do that last. A model of the Kara. It's like a Turian Titanic, the way I hear it. Have we ever actually seen a Turian ship in game? Wow. Imagine that thing coming at you in a dark alley. I'd rather not, to be honest. This is nice. Oddly relaxing. What is it? <laughs> Doesn't look like much, but that might be one of the most valuable pieces here. Turian art is rare outside of Palavin. For good reason, I say. Huh? Hawk has good taste. I'll give him that. He fucking loves Krogan, doesn't he? He's got a bunch of Krogan statues. Ugh. Rachni Queen. I guess everything's valuable to someone. He fucking loves Krogan. He's got a Krogan kink. I feel like its eyes are following me. Yikes. This looks like Quarian script. Wow. This has got to be old. When was the last time the Quarians wrote on stone? That's impressive. Not sure what it is, though. Me neither. Uh, was there anything I can say about this? Oh, yeah. Michelangelo's David. Just. Wow. 
Think we could get this out through the door? <laughs> Probably should have recognized that, huh? Not a big art, dude. That's a Casa Locust. No, the Casa Locust. The gun that killed two presidents. Oh? Gorgeous. It even comes with a perfect copy, too. <laughs> was that to give to squad I'm mates? Sure Hawk won't mind if we borrowed these. Now, what's this? <laughs> yep. Locust SMG acquired. The following squad mates are now able to use this weapon. Shep and Miranda, Morden, Samara, Thane, and Kasumi. They, they, they had to go, this is a one-of-a-kind weapon. And then they went, shit, we need to make the squad mates available to, to use it. This is a one-of-a-kind weapon with a perfect replica. <laughs> why, would, why would he even have a perfect replica sat next to the actual thing? <laughs> that looks pretty cool, though. Oh, my God. There it is. OMG. Don't bother Miss Goto. It's code locked. Hello. I had a feeling that was you at the door. I knew if it was really you, you'd get through anyway. You know me. I don't like to disappoint. I need what's in your grey box, Kasumi. You know I'm willing to kill you for it. I'll admit your skills are impressive. You got into my vault like I'd left it open. But you're still going to die screaming. <laughs> Have I got your attention? <laughs> <laughs> that shut him up. Kill them. Oh, I don't think so. How the fuck did he think it was Kasumi at the door when he's ahead. never seen her? That's such a random thought to have. Like, he must meet so many people. And then he sees this one person for five like seconds that? and he's like, that's definitely that one person from years ago. Can't reach the target. Ow, ow, ow. Oh, fuck, that's the cheat. I've made a mistake. Let's get out of here. Joker, bring the shuttle in. Now. Okay. Which way is east? Not this way, apparently. Did you... Are we just going back up the stairs? Is that what we're supposed to be doing? I like that alarm noise. Wow. Oh, this isn't the way we came in. Oh, I'm stupid. I thought... Right, yeah. Up ahead. Hi. Are those explosive? I guess not. Okay, hello, hello, I see. Have we mapped her, uh... You know, use, use the SMG. We, we have not mapped the Shadow Strike. Do you do that? Actually doesn't do as much as I was expecting, honestly. Whee! Does Overload do any more on him? Nah. Shadow Strike does do more. Why am I even fucking around? Just fucking get the particle beam and rinse this dude. See, that went fine. Don't know what you guys are worrying about. I know you're worried right there. Wait, where did he go? Where the fuck did he go? Did he die? I thought he still had a full bar of health left. Am I losing my mind? Damn it! We have to find another way. I guess it blew up somehow. 
I could have sworn it had a full bar of health left or something, but like, yeah, I guess not. Do do do, bomb. Something up there to hack. Hacker man. I'm a hacker man. Boop. Lovely jubbly. Hello. The incredible melee man, he's come for us all. The incredible melee man. Oh fuck, the incredible melee man just missed his melee. weapons than that to blow those tanks. Okay, anything to look for? That's where we came in from, right? Yeah. What do we got? Do I just see... Oh, volatile tanks. Am I supposed to explode these? Oh, can I use this? Ah. Oh, I totally did miss stuff over here. Wow, it really doesn't want me to climb those barriers. Damn, I almost missed all of this. It's a good thing we had to actually do this, or I would have totally missed this entire thing. If I could have just walked out that door, I totally would have. Yeah, that gets the job done. With my property, you forgot to say the rest of your line. Hello! Oh, he's fucking come at you from behind! Just the way you like it. It does have another bar of health at the bottom, so I just don't know how it died last time. Maybe like that. Did I did I set her off to do her thing? Do I not have incendiary ammo active? God damn it. You're not gonna get her? Going silent. Is that the way to go? I'll take. Oh, love a bit of tech damage. Tasty fucking stuff. Can't reach the target. What the fuck was that shit? He like started to charge up and then failed. Haha. <laughs> that was strange. Yeah, that is the way to go. Nothing over here. Door open. I'm taking care of this myself. Oh, sweet, we got a shotgun this prick in the head. Fuck yeah. Here they come. I can't believe I missed that. Oh 
my god, why am I so bad at aiming? Alright, Donny boy. Where you at, bro? Donovan, Donovan Hawk? More like Donovan Schmuck. <laughs> got him. Fucking got him. He's never recovering from that. I don't even need to shoot him now, because that's already killed him. Anything down here? I, I know a battlefield when I see one. Uh oh, is he going to be in a jet? Yep. Could have done this the easy way. Allow me to show you the hard way. Damn, am I not okay. going to get to shotgun him? Those shields look like fucking invincibility shields. Can I actually shoot them or... Taking fire. They did look like they were going down. Woo, that's some damage though. Fuck me. Was this good against shields? Highly accurate? No. Oh, this is weak against shields. As you wish. Whoa! It just really looked like he had more of a barrier. Like, it didn't look like I could easily take it down. Wait, what the fuck? He just fully regened it. That's illegal. Wait. That's illegal. Should we try out this SMG? Oh, that's pretty good. Oh my goodness. Now that is illegal. What the fuck? This thing rips. Oh my goodness. He's got so much ammo as well. What the fuck? That's actually amazing. Is there anyone else left to kill? What's going on now? That. <laughs> Would help if I could aim, you know, but... I can't believe his fucking entire shield bar just regen to full right when I got done. Oh, fuck. What did you tell your friend, Kasumi? You're doing this for love? Uh, is she Got not? I can get to the ship. I can take down the shield. Okay. How would you get to the ship? What am I missing here? I feel like I'm missing something. Am I missing something? No? Never mind. Got a clear shot. Here we go. Damn, you look like fucking Spider-Man there, dude. 
that is Spider-Man posed to the max. Shooters Shields out, girl. Down. Let's tear that thing apart. I thought she was gonna say, "Let's tear that thing a new one." I'll do that too. Surprise, bitch! I'm back with my super laser. Nice fucking health, bro. Would be a shame if anything were to happen to it. Like it just got fucking annihilated. Oh my god, I can't aim for shit. Fucking do the limbo, lovely stuff. They're to our left. Are they? Yeah, no, that's not where the left is. Fucking shotgunned it out the sky, bitch. Have a squadron of what? Fucking Grim Reapers. Fuck you. Now what? Ah, this. <laughs> what a little bitch. Bye. Peace out. Peace. Here we go. Kasumi, if you're seeing this, it's because I'm dead. The information we found is all here. It's big, Kasumi. If the council ever got wind of this, the Alliance could be implicated. Uh-oh, what have Kasumi, those fuckers been up to? I encrypted the information to keep it safe. And I uploaded the encryption key to your grey box, so no one could get the whole package. But if I'm dead, and if anyone knows about this, then I've made you a target, my love. I'm so... so sorry. Keiji. I know you, Kasumi. You'll want to keep these memories forever. But you don't need some neural implant to know I'll always be with you. Kasumi, oh. destroy these files. There's nothing more I can do to protect you. I... I can't do that. This is all that's left. Goodbye, Kasumi. I love you. Damn. She wants to relive those fucking sex memories. Is there any way we can just destroy the information? No. Keiji's a master at encrypting files. He laced the information into his memories. You can't get one without experiencing the other. Huh. That's interesting. Keep the Grey Box is the Paragon, and destroy the Grey Box is Renegade. But he wants her to destroy it. And I kind of agree with him. Like... It's nice that you have the memories, but if you keep them forever, like, I don't know, you're just going to be, like, tied to them in a way, I guess. Huh. I'm surprised that it's this way around. I thought destroying it would be the Paragon thing to, like, you know, go with his last wishes and stop her from being too attached to it, I guess. I'm going to go with destroy, because that's what I, I feel like that's the right thing to do here. Hawk knew you had the cipher. I'm sure others do too. It's only a matter of time before someone finds you and the secret gets out. You're right. I know. 
I just... It feels like I'm losing him. Again. If it's easier, I could do it for you. I... Okay. Just get it over with. Please. You got it. Adios, amigo. There we go. Do, 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 do. The heist was successful. Keiji Okuda's grey box was recovered and all information contained within was destroyed. Donovan Hawk was killed in the destruction of his gunship. Kasumi is loyal. Bit of experience. Flashbang grenade. We already had it, obviously. Kasumi's new outfit. Oh, right. I forgot to check Miranda's new outfit as well. Uh, that seems fucking great. Tech damage. 60k credits. Oh man, we need to go shopping soon. We need to go on the trip of a lifetime. To the shops. Commander, you've received a new message at your private terminal. Oh. Guardian Angels from Oriana. Lawson. Nice. I hope this is the right Commander Shepard. Are there any others? I'm Oriana. My sister only told me a little, but I don't think it occurred to her that I'm as smart as she is. I poked around a little and found an information broker who got me this address. Interesting. So I guess you wouldn't get this email if you didn't tell Miranda to go and talk to her? I got to thank her, but I, but I never got to thank you for helping me. My parents don't really understand it, but I know how much Miranda did, how many little things over the years were her looking out for me. I'm not going to tell them. I still want to go to school and get some degrees, but I wanted you to know that I know you saved me. I had a guardian angel all these years. I don't know if my sister has anybody. She said that she's working for you, and it was pretty clear you were doing something dangerous. Make sure she comes back alive, okay? Oriana. P.S. Don't tell her I sent you this. It would just make her angry. P.P.S. Miranda, quit looking at Shepard's messages. Oh, don't act like you don't. It's what I'd do. Uh-oh. she been going through our fucking shit? Miranda? How dare? Can't remember if we've asked Joker about Kasumi or not, so let's have a listen. That was a bit of a longer mission than the first one. Commander, what do you think about the people? Well, we're picking up? I would never say anything against what? Miranda. And it, I'm not saying it, it's just my opinion, though. There's really That's it for now. Okay. Commander. He doesn't register that we just went out with Kasumi, I guess. Weird. I mean, it's different to normal ones because we could only take Kasumi and not take anyone else. And I guess that just means he doesn't realize it's happened. Strange. Hey, Shepard. I really appreciate your help with the Hawk heist. You're welcome. I don't know why we had to destroy Keiji's grey box, but it doesn't make it any easier. Edie has a wicked sense of humor. Or I should say, a really funny lack of one. Sometimes she seems like a person, but when it comes down to it, I can't get past her being a computer. This one security guy keeps staring at me. Are these all new? I think his name is Bert. I'm used to being watched by security, but they're usually staring at my eyes or watching my hands. I might have to start cloaking through the CIA. Oh, no, I remember that one. Come back later. I'm sure I'll have more to talk about. I remember that one. Aight. Cool. Well, there we go. Another loyalty mission in the books. And uh, another squad mate loyal. How do I... Uh, where's Morden? Oh, Morden's just here, right? And when I say Morden, I mean the research thing. Is it something I can just... Do I have to buy the uh, retrained powers or something? To be able to swap my thingy? I'm not sure. Or oh, wait, advanced training. Oh! Oh, never mind. Through in I, I completely missed this. Through intensive training, Shepard can learn to use a single bonus power. Obtaining more loyal squad, squad members will increase the number of powers available. Shepard can complete this project multiple times. Each time the project's completed, Shepard selects a new bonus power and any points already spent transfer to the newly selected power. Holy fuck, it costs 5,000 EZO. The rarest thing by a million miles and also a fuckload of it. 
You can complete this research project multiple times, but by the way, you're not going to be able to afford it. Well, shit. I don't know if I want Miranda's power. And obviously I've already got Kasumi's. I guess we'll sit on that for a while then. Because that's fucking super expensive. Get the tech damage though. Lovely jubbly. Get the tech cooldowns. Lovely jubbly. That was also super expensive on the Ezo front. But that's like definitely worth. Whereas I don't think swapping to Miranda's power is definitely worth. Uh, alrighty. Very good. That is where we will end off for today. Thank you very much for watching. If you've enjoyed, if you could leave a like and subscribe if you haven't already. Share the videos around. Share the playlist around if you can. I would really appreciate that. And I'll see you next time when we continue on down the long list of loyalty missions. Very, very good too to start off with. Looking forward to the next ones. Thanks again. See you then.